Okie dokie, it's Friday, I think it's Friday. What are we? It is Friday. I'm glad it's Friday because that's what um, calendar I'm working off. Um, early start, uh, we've had our, yeah, well it's just, just after six at the moment, um, already hit some sessions. Uh, it, it's going to be a bit of a mix mash sort of a day. Uh, you know, we've got obviously PT through the morning. I've got, I've still got programming to do. That's going to be on my task list uh, for a long time. Hopefully not for a long time, but for the next uh, at least two weeks, uh, just with Christmas coming up, um, prepping everybody for that. Um, I mean, yeah, early start. So to the extent where I haven't even finished my coffee yet, I've still got an inch or so of coffee. Um, happy days. Uh, it's always nice to have a surprise coffee. Uh, but no, so today, what's the plan today? I've got my calendar here. Yeah, PT, running PT back to back this morning. Um, I've got a little bit of a break now. I'm gonna sneak in hopefully a couple thousand steps um, just so I don't have to do that later on. Uh, then I'll get my training, it's a big day. We have our posterior day uh, today. Hamstrings, 10 by 10s uh, with our deadlifts. So good, they're still recovering from last week, but we're gonna smash them again today anyway. Um, they should have recovered already by now. Um, at least enough to simulate a little bit of growth. High calorie day as well, just to complement that. So I'm not too sure about this high cows. Um, I'll, I'll have to tweak it a little bit. Uh, had some honey on my oats this morning. Um, yeah, I increased the numbers, the actual uh, volume of oats anyway. Um, but yeah, something about honey on oats just wasn't right for me this morning so uh, maybe it's just i'm used to that that peanut butter and, and oats versus the sweet so don't know i'll have a play i might have to um swap it out for a bit of toast or something or maybe it's just some decent cereal or i don't know we'll, we'll have a play and see what um see what comes up um they're only two days a week anyway being leg days uh what else have we got Training. I think we're going to go and well, we are going to go and see uh, a couple of houses. We've got some house inspections this morning. Um, hopefully, we'll be able to find something we like and you know get out of this rental for the you know by you know six months time or so. I think our lease is up in May. I think May, April. I don't know, somewhere around there. Um, so. Yeah, sick of, it, sick of the renting market. Just want to get out and actually buy something, make it our own. Um, of course, they have to meet our criteria. Uh, you know, I've got to have space to set. Obviously, you're trying to set the gym up. You can see there's a bit of, bit of stuff there, dumbbells, the rack. Uh, so whether that's a shed or under their house, or I, I don't know, uh, we'll see what's available. Um, two houses we're seeing today, to be quite honest, I don't think either will suit, uh, but they're both stunning houses, so it might be a matter of, if we get accepted, just building a shed myself, uh, and, or, or building, a, you know, an outhouse or something to, to put the, uh, the studio in. But, I don't know, that's, that's for later today. At the moment, I'm just going to get some steps and uh, get on with the morning, I guess, finish my coffee. And we're back, just a, a quick update uh, for everyone. Um, missed a heap of footage today. Um, training went well, um, it was a big session, I think it was about hour 15 or so, so by the end of it, it's just, you know, is it really worth trying to continue on to get the best out of it? Admittedly, I don't know what everyone's going to say. Oh, you know, maybe you should just call it quits at you know an hour or so. No. Um, in all honesty, I was stuffing around. I was answering messages uh, in between sets, and my rest periods got blew out a little bit. So, all in, um, my posterior day usually takes just over an hour, and it's usually quite full on. So today was just the exception. Um, definitely going to feel it tomorrow. Uh, the, the GVT training is. Um, it's brutal, uh, especially with GVTs on, on deadlifts. Uh, what else we got? We got, um, did end up going to see that house. I'm just shaking this camera around. 
got a Blair Witch camera on. Um, we did go and see this house, uh, absolutely stunning. Um, we do have to go and have a chat to our broker though, which is, uh, well, we gave her a call. Uh, she's not in the office today, it's a radio. Uh, so she's gonna give us a call back on Monday, which is completely fair. You know, we're all entitled to, to have a day off. Uh, so it's unfortunate at the same time in that it's a stunning house. They've had multiple offers on it. Uh, none were accepted. So uh, what they've done is actually increased their price, their, their asking price um, about 10 grand because of the multiple offers. And, and rightly so, I think it is quite, quite fairly priced. Our issue is that because we are both self-employed, we, uh, the, the banks will see our tax returns at end of financial year. It's not like being an employee where you can go out and, and apply for a loan at any, uh, any time of the year. We, we, I mean, we can apply any time of the year, but you know, if you're an employee, you know, you've just got to be employed for so many months versus uh, self-employed like we, we both are. Uh, the banks will base our borrowing capacity around our tax return. So this year we, we went well. This year it's a hell of a lot better than the year before. Um, let's not talk about the year before. It was, that was a, a hair in my mouth. That was a bit of a shit show uh, the year prior. Um, found an amazing house last year, applied for that. Um, they accepted the offer. We, we ended up getting, what did we get? I think it was about 25 grand less than asking price. So we, we had an amazing deal on it. Uh, what we were going to pay uh, turned out to be about 150 grand less than the value of the property itself. So it would have been an amazing, amazing house um, to move into. But unfortunately, it wasn't meant to be. We got well, we got approved for the loan, but it, it wasn't our our asking price. So yeah, toughed it out. Um, got our debt down, um, and then this year, yeah, we've uh, all but doubled our borrowing capacity. Uh, we just have to get the final pre-approval from the banks. So that being said, though. It's still not quite as high as I would have liked. So we, we still have to um, knuckle down. And uh, yeah, increase our income, uh, which will in increase our borrowing capacity. Still got this hair. <laughs> um, but no, beautiful house. Um, hopefully we'll hear back from our broker uh, early Monday. Um, from what the, the real estate agent was saying today, there were, I'm sure there'll be multiple offers this weekend at the open house. Uh, so I'm fully expecting a multiple offer, bidding war type deal. Um, so I'm not holding my breath to be quite honest, but you know, it'd be nice, it'd be a, it's a beautiful house. The joys of being self-employed. Um, but no, so that's where we are. Um, scored some lunch and now we're here on the treddy. So uh, I figured I'd set myself a little challenge, uh, rack up 25,000 steps by the end of the day, which is, I, th I think I think when I started this, I uh, started on the treddy, I was at about, I think it was 13,000. So, I mean, what's an extra 12,000? It'll take me an hour and a half, I think. You know, pulling numbers out of thin air. Um, but no, we'll see how we go. At the moment, we're six minutes in, half a kilometer. So let's get to it. Let's wrap this video up. Um, not much is gonna to happen tonight. I'm just gonna dice up some chicken and really just relax for the evening. Uh, look, all in, 
really rock solid day. Um, our team this morning killed it. Everybody's in a great place. Um, a, a real nice safe position to get them prepared for Christmas, um, which is really cool to see. Um, it's not very often that we get everyone uh, in, in a similar situation, which is, yeah, so awesome. Um, Step-wise, yeah, we're about to cross over 25,000 now, so uh, that's gonna be a piece of cake. Weight, I've got no idea what my weight is at the moment since it's the end of the day. Uh, what else we do? Training, training was good, posterior day, GVT uh, with my deadlifts. Uh, yeah, they, they're, <laughs> they're brutal. Uh, house-wise, yeah, you know about the house. Um, nothing much more to report on that one. Uh, look, all in, really rock solid day. Um, just gonna have some dinner, chicken and salad wraps, uh, and a little bit of ice cream for dessert. And that'll be us done, so another one in the books.